What's up guys, John Mack here and welcome back to my channel. Again, this particular video is part of a home exercise series na ginagawa ko right now. Eventually, mag-upload din ako ng mga gym exercises or gym programs na ginagawa ko in the future. But for today, let's talk about building a better shoulder. So, maraming advantages ang malaking shoulder. Una, uh, mas maganda mag-fit yung mga damit mo. Kasi parang, 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 parang hanger, di ba? Parang model, no? Uh, reverse T yung, or reverse pyramid yung... Uh, yung fisik mo. Pangalawa, kailangan mo ng strong shoulders para mag-progress ka sa mga ibang exercises, especially chest-related exercises. Alam naman natin, pag ginagawa mo yung chest, may kasamang front shoulder yan. So, proper stance, alam nyo na, again, uh, check nyo na lang on the link down below. Pero kailangan proper stance ka dito kasi overhead weight-bearing exercise siya. So, kailangan-kailangan solid yung foundation mo. So, yung grip na re-recommend ko for shoulder raise is choke grip. Why? Explain ko later. But uh, you can do this nakaupo or nakatayo. So ang hawak mo is pag ganito, yung neutral position mo. Tapos hindi siya kailangan nakaganito guys. Kasi pag ganitong position, more or less nakakastrain sa wrist. So kaya mo lang na medyo natural na, na resting position ng wrist mo. Alright? Again, ang focus mo is sa shoulders, hindi sa wrist. Tapos pag, pag ginigrip mo yung dumbbell mo, kailangan is grip mo tight dito pag nilak mo to itong uh, thumb mo sa yung pointer finger mo kasi mapapansin mo pag nilak mo yan ng ma madiin nagiging solid yung uh, forearm mo so hindi kumbaga magewang yung weights and syempre hindi ka may injure alright guys so ito yung resting ay isa pang masishare ko sa inyo guys hindi nandito ang weight medyo kailangan nakaabante siya ng konti alright Madala, madalas mga nag injure kasi yung dito or parang behind the neck press na yung nangyayari so kailangan when you do your, your dumbbell races medyo nakaabante ng konti yung weight sa ulo mo so ganito siya guys So make sure, pag tinaas mo siya, not necessarily sobrang sagad naman. Basta, mafe-feel mo na nag-flex na yung shoulder mo. Yung front shoulder mo. Or yung front delt. Tapos, pag nag ka, medyo stretch mo. Kailangan guys, medyo parang na-stretch mo naman ng konti. Hindi, hindi kailangan nandito, kailangan nandito. Again guys, I recommend reverse pyramid style and training, meaning your heaviest sets should be your first sets. That way, mas mabilis ka makakapag-progress sa heavier weights, which translates into better strength gains, and therefore, syempre, susunod yung growth ng muscle doon. Provided na maayos yung diet mo, or you're having a high protein diet. That's it for this video guys. If you find this one informative, don't forget to drop a like down below, and consider subscribing to this channel. Again, I will upload similar exercises, kaya either you check the description down below, or you can also check my playlist para makita nyo pa yung mga ibang home exercises na pwedeng-pwede nyong gawin. Salamat sa panonood. Again, John Mack here, and see you on my next one.